Super quick video today, I was not planning on posting anything, but we just had something crazy happen on the profile and I just had to share it. So here's what happened. Before we start the video, I am 29,717 subscribers away from YouTube rank. So if you could click that sub button, it'd really help me out a lot and make this journey a whole lot quicker. I walked into this end lobby planning to grind some void glooms and I immediately saw this notification. In the end, there is a mini boss called the end stone protector. It spawns somewhere in the dragon's nest after players in the lobby have killed 5,000 zealots. There's some pretty cool RNG loot, but usually you will get an endstone rose, some pearls, and enchanted endstone for defeating it. This is how the fight normally goes. This is how the fight that I did today went. For some unknown reason, someone in the lobby decided to lasso the endstone protector, and then using tarot boots, they just yeeted it up into the air to bring it all the way from the bottom of the dragon's nest to the top of the actual map. And I think their plan was to put it in the void. I'm not entirely sure, but they almost got there until we managed to kill it right on the edge of the island. What you're about to hear is my first reaction. I was actually recording luckily because the endstone protect fight was so weird. And I thought, oh, I have to show someone. I never in my life expected what I was about to see below. Oh my God. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go. Bro. There is no way. There is actually no way. Oh my god. <laughs> I should probably explain why this is so insane. Not only was that the most scuffed boss fight I've ever done, but I didn't even think I was eligible for this particular drop. Similar to how the loot table works for dragons, a player must reach a minimum weight in order to roll for these RNG drops. For the tier boost core, I needed 250. Weight is calculated by this formula. I didn't kill any zealots, so that's gonna be zero. I placed first in damage, so my base weight is 200. Because I placed first, I multiply 50 times 100% of damage dealt, giving me 50 additional weight. For those that didn't pass first grade maths class, we now have a sum of 250 weight the exact minimum to roll for a tier boost core. If I didn't place first, I would have missed out on this ridiculously rare item. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know in the comments down below if you've gotten any super rare RNG drops lately, or maybe if you've had terrible luck recently. With all that said, I'll see you in the next one.